Hello my family members. Today we will solve a coding problem that was asked on Accenture of Campus 2023 on 26th June Drive. It will be better if you just watch the question part and solve by yourself. If problem occurs then come to watch. Right. And I will request you to please watch the playlist regarding previous year paper I am uploading and I have been uploading. Link is given in the description box. Kindly go through that and please subscribe this channel to be late to get the latest update regarding Accenture. Okay, let's start with the question. The question was regarding sum of digits. Problem statement is you are required to implement the following function in different sum of digits and the function accepts an array error of n positive integers as its argument. Let's suppose sum of digits of an integer fx you are required to calculate the uh, value of the following right. This actually you have to calculate this value right. I am explaining how is this happening. Uh, the integer value of the total element of array is 10 and element of the arrays are this right and what your task is your task is to add or sum all of the element in the array first and this would be stored in a variable f2 right and in the first variable f1 you have to add or sum all the digits in exist in the array right so what is the total sum of the digits exist in the array that is 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 4 plus 1 plus 6 plus 1 plus 0 plus 9 plus 8 plus 2 plus 4 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 right so this will be if you add all digits then it would be 50 right and after all you have to divide by 10 what will be the remainder will be stored in the variable f1 right that is 0 right so and you have to sum all the element exist in the array so 11 plus 14 plus 16 plus 10 plus 9 plus 8 plus 24 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 that would be 104 right and 104 mod 10 means 4 that is if we divide 104 by 10 then the remainder will be 4 right so according to the given proposal we have to we have to actually differentiate between f1 minus f2 so the sum when we did with all digits that was 0 sorry after the calculation it was 0 and sum of all digits sum of all the numbers is uh, 104 and the calculation was minus 4 only 4 right so 0 minus 4 is equal to that is f1 minus f2 f1 was after all the calculation was 0 and after second calculation it was 4 so 0 minus 4 is equal to minus 4 right there is another explanation and another input that is 16 18 20 here you can understand this problem easily that is 1 plus 6 is equal to 7 plus 1 8 8 plus 8 is equal to 16 plus 2 is equal to 18 right and uh, this is the digit sum right and if you add the element then then 16 plus 18 is equal to 34 and 20 is equal to 54 so if we divide by 4 what will be the remainder in case here here uh, in case of 54 the, the remainder will be and in case of 18 the remainder will be 8 right so 8 minus 4 is equal to 4 right so the answer will be 4 in this way you have to solve the problem if you can solve the problem kindly solve the problem by yourself okay otherwise it will be no beneficial I mean it will be not benefited right because you have to understand the problem you have to able you have to be able to solve the problem right so solve by yourself first if not possible then only see the logic and solve right don't watch full video and just copy right okay let's start with the answer actually we can define another 
function which calculates the sum of digits right like uh, sum of digits it will be easier for solution right sum of digits num num is the argument there will be many ways to calculate the digits sum right i am just doing this part if you know python then uh, you can solve the problem you can solve the sum of digits easily or if you know another logic then also it is okay but i am just using this logic to calculate the uh, sum of digits and it will be very much actually uh, easier and time and time not time consuming right this is for digit in str now right only this one line will help you to return the sum of all digits right and you can do the another logic like uh, take all remainder uh, remainder and add them one by one right and divide the whole number by 10 so the number will be reduced by uh, one digit right this way you can also store the sum of digits but i am not doing this because it will uh, extend that uh, video time so do it by yourself okay let's start with the next function that was on difference actually the actual function difference um let's just diff and diff uh, the, the the arguments are array and the size of the array right so here i also uh, I, I i will also use a very shortcut python code right so you can use another logic right i am mentioning again and again right sum of sum of digits num for num in array right and f2 is equal to just if i'm explaining why what it is doing here right i'm explaining the logic just write, let me write the code first f2 is equal to sum of just error right it will do it will add all the elements one by one just one line of code in python will add all the element right so it is very easier right so what is the let's say result is equal to f1 minus f2 right and let's write the driver code driver so the array is equal to array is equal to um, list map int input sorry split because we have to take input in one line right so array and let run the function diff diff error and size of the array that is uh, let's say okay we will take the input as well n is equal to int input right guys if you face any problem then let me know that right okay let's start i think this will be okay let me take the size of the array at first right? okay so let's say three is the first size of the array and in single line i will take input of element right so this is saying none but this was supposed to be sorry actually i had to return the result right okay i think this will be okay so three was the size of the first uh, second array right second input second in uh, array element are 16 plus 18 plus 20 sorry this is saying that minus 36 but there must be some problem oh actually i did not do another uh i mean what i was supposed to do was that f1 
sorry i was supposed to do this right i hope uh, you have got this right and <laughs> actually mistakes makes us more comfortable with the code right okay let's run 3 was the size and 16 18 and 20 okay let's see this was for uh, outputs was 4 and this is giving also 4 let's run the first port first input that was um size was 10 and the elements were 11 14 16 10 9 8 24 4 and 3 right let's see the output is minus 4 and the desired output was also minus 4 okay this code is okay and the code is running smoothly guys if you have any problem then let me know right and if you uh want to know this line then i am mentioning that actually this part for num in array in python this is a list comprehension that iterates over each element right each element and num in the array right and it essentially takes each integer from the array one by one right and this part sum of digits num is actually taking this num value right so let's say the uh, the array element was 16 18 and 20 right so when uh, the for loop hovering from iterating from zeroth index to last index let's say at first the num is 16 right so when num is 16 it is taking the num as an argument sum of digits and this is and actually doing the addition of this all digits that is 1 plus 6 right and after all the all sum of digits are all together again being added with this function that is sum right so this way it is uh, doing the sum function uh, the, it is actually um, functioning all the function within a same same time right so i think uh, you have been answered the question and guys if you face any problem again and again i'm saying and if you want to watch all the previous year question asked in accenture and if you want to watch another video and other companies video then kindly let me know i will obviously give importance to your uh, comment your ways right because you are here so i am right okay i hope you have already subscribed this channel and already have been watching the playlist i have been doing right so thank you guys for today's session